हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई से अकेडमी In this lecture, let us understand generation of FM signal using indirect method, which is also known as Armstrong modulator. This is the simplified block diagram of indirect FM system. In this method, the message signal is first used to produce the narrow band FM. Then this signal is applied to frequency multiplier to increase the frequency deviation to the desired level. the frequency multiplier produces the wide band fm signal that is indicated by s dash of t this indirect method of fm generation scheme is also known as armstrong wide band frequency modulator here the message signal is first integrated and then it is used to phase modulate a carrier signal generated by a crystal oscillator which will produce a narrow band fm which is indicated by s of t it will be having a carrier frequency of fc and modulation index less than 1 therefore the narrow band fm can be given as s of t is equal to ac cos 2 pi fc t plus 2 pi kf integration of m of t dt let us call this as equation number 1 here the crystal oscillator is used to provide the frequency stability this narrow band fm is then given as input to the frequency multiplier and this frequency multiplier will produce the required wide band fm which is indicated by s dash of t This is the block diagram of frequency multiplier. Frequency multiplier consists of a memoryless non-linear device which is followed by a band pass filter with center frequency n into fc. The output of band pass filter will be a wide band fm signal that is indicated by s dash of t. Here the output of memoryless device is indicated as v of t. so we can write v of t is equal to a1 s of t plus a2 s square of t plus a3 s cube of t plus and so on up to an s to the power of n t let us call this as equation number 2 here s of t is narrow band fm signal with carrier frequency fc and modulation index beta so here s of t is indicated in equation number 1 the instantaneous frequency of narrow band fm we can write it as fi of t is equal to fc plus kf m of t when this output of memoryless device is passed through a band pass filter with center frequency n into fc we will get the required wide band fm signal that can be indicated as s dash of t therefore s dash of t we can write it as ac cos 2 pi fc dash t plus 2 pi kf dash integration of m of t dt let us take this as equation number 3 and this equation number 3 indicates the required wide band fm signal here fc dash is equal to n fc and kf dash is equal to n kf and beta dash is equal to n beta the instantaneous frequency of wide band fm can be given as fi dash of t is equal to fc dash plus kf dash m of t therefore we can say we have obtained a required wide band fm signal 
using this block diagram. This is about indirect method of generation of FM signal or Armstrong modulator. I hope you have understood the topic. Thank you.